the smallest member out of everyone in the gang. The Howard Stern Show. Hi, Claudia. You're on the air. Hi. Um, I just want to congratulate Robin on her animal rights views that she expressed on Friday. What was that? Oh, I understand. I said something you animal rights lovers like. What did you say? Um, she was talking about how she saw um, Turning Point and how... What is Turning Point? It was this TV show. I told you about it. And they show, showed all these animals and how animals think and have emotions. Yeah. And I said they shouldn't be used for research. I got to tell you something. You know, I, I do all my work in my basement, so I put some fish in there, right? <laughs> oh, you finally got the fish? Yeah, I got some fish in there. I don't have the real... I'm looking for oddities. I'm looking for fish that are oddities. <laughs> so I've been collecting now oddities. But right now in You're my tank... you kill some oddities? Yeah. <laughs> but right now in my tank, I have uh, just regular fish because yes. the acid balances off and, and these fish, you know, they drop dead. Who cares? Oh, <laughs> so, my gosh. Yeah. So See? anyway, <laughs> they're testing the waters. So anyway... You know, in the ocean, they just live. You don't have to yeah. test. Hey, honey, this is just fish. Don't get all emotional, okay? Um, well, I still think they shouldn't be in a tank. They, they don't have a brain in their head. Well, they, they do. Well, they be free. I mean, how would you like to be, like, trapped in a room all your life? I'll you try to swim like that underwater and not have to... Uh, Sweetheart, these fish, these fish are eating shrimp every day, okay? Don't tell me they have it rough. Okay, okay, fine. All right? I your mean, fish are eating shrimp. Right. So anyway... Heavy on. I got these fish, and I'm looking at them. I go, gee, that one looks hungry. And I go, wait a second, you stupid ass. <laughs> You're putting human emotions on these fish. Okay. They're dumb fish that should be eaten. I got a grouper in there. I'm just, I'm fattening them up so I can eat them. <laughs> okay. You're going fishing. I got a beautiful Hawaiian grouper. Nice. I think drop a line. <laughs> yeah, drop a line. I should go fishing in my goddamn tank. You can't put your, you can't put your fingers in my tank either because the fish will eat your fingers. What kind of fish do you have? They all have, they all have huge teeth. <laughs> you should see the size of their teeth. I got an eel, a six hundred dollar eel. Some guy loaned me. I'm not going to buy my pay no six hundred dollars. But man, it looks weird. What happens if something happens to the fish in your custody? Uh, no, I, uh, some other guy takes care of them. I got nothing to do with it. I just look at them. But these fish, I'm, I'm sitting there going, oh, look at the fish. He's having a good time. I go, hey, dumbass. Plants, plants have more feelings than fish. Oh, gosh, no. I, this, is not, this is not the guy to talk to, let me tell no, you. Well, I just wanted to congratulate you. What are you, a vegetarian or something? Um, vegan. A vegan? Um, vegan is like no animal products, like no honey. Oh, milk. so you eat fish? No. No. No milk, Nothing eggs, living. honey. Nothing. You're a vegan? Yeah. What's a vegan? They don't like eat anything. Vegetarians don't eat meat. Vegans yeah. don't eat cheese, honey. You won't they don't eat cheese? Eat animal products. No. Honey, wait a second. Let me get this straight. You won't eat cheese? No. Why? Because it comes from milk? Yeah, they give them hormones. And they just, you, you must have goddamn rickets and a hunch in your back. Uh, no. no <laughs> I'll tell you something. You must look like a rickety old bitch. <laughs> no, no way. You wouldn't eat cheese? No. I'm only you 17. Want... Why am I going to look like that? What is it? You won't eat cheese, and you won't eat what else? Anything from animals. Honey. Anything honey? Honey. honey is from an animal? Okay, well, honey comes from bees. Okay, you can... Bees? <laughs> <laughs> honey comes from a bee? Yes. Yes. It does? Oh, my God. Oh, what is that, bee crap? Yes. Oh, bee well, vomit. <laughs> I don't have anything against honey that much, but as long as I'm away from other animal products, I mean, I might as well stay away from honey, too. You're completely out of control. <laughs> no, I'm not. Like, I don't eat any red meat. That's enough. I'll eat chickens, though. They're dumb as, a, they're dumb as plants. Oh, no, but they kill You ever see a chicken? Chicken's stupid. <laughs> I'm so horribly. It doesn't matter how stupid they are. I eat are, chicken. But... I eat turkey. I, I eat. Uh, I eat fish. All that stuff. You need it. I don't need it. I'm no vegan. <laughs> Soy milk, tofu, all these other um, proteins and calciums and all that. You don't need to kill animals for that. Chickens are nice and dirty. I like them. They're dirtier than Chinese. If you, if you, what? Yeah, you know how they all live in the same house? Yeah. Hundreds of them. I've seen pictures. They're dirtier than Indians. Well, why don't we eat them? <laughs> I would. Nobody will serve me. Oh, yeah. I heard about you in Vietnam and everything. I was in Vietnam. Yeah, I heard about you. Yeah, you should have been there. You wouldn't be no vegan. Oh. Uh, Leg of Tonto. Yes, there's only uh, a couple of animal lovers on this show. He's not one of them. <laughs> yeah. So, Robin, I... I even think that his pet should be taken away from him. He I'd eat it horribly. I'd eat cat. <laughs> <laughs> I would. I really your think they should be taken cat. away. What? You would eat your daughter's cat and their hamster? Yes, I'd eat a hamster. Why not? Oh my gosh, that's sure. so cruel. Sure, I'd cook it up and eat it. Toss them in a microwave. <laughs> <laughs> Set hamsters up on the shelf in case there's a bomb <laughs> blast or something. I'd eat your cat. Oh. My cat? No way. Read between the lines. I don't mean cat. Oh, uh, oh shut up.
Yeah. I eat that. Do you eat this that? This is a 17-year-old. No. Is it? Down. Is she 17? She she's 17. in college right now. Are you 17? Yeah. Oh, I guess I couldn't eat your cat. See, that is sick. <laughs> Call back. Call back in a year and I'll eat your cat. Oh, no, no, December I'll be. Disgusting. Oh, December she's going to be 18. She's legal. She's not. She's, oh, by the, she's 17. Honey, you know, the way you're eating, you might live till 22. <laughs> no, I mean, I'm like much more healthier than I was when I did eat meat and everything. Yeah, sure. I uh, am, yeah, I swear. You can ask my doctor and everything. Are you a pig? <laughs> Ow. You're not? Obviously not. She hardly eats. Right. Can you stand up? Yes, I'm fine. Right. The rickets? Ew. Shut up. No. All right, so what, so what did you want to say? Well, I'd just like to congratulate Robin on her views because I know that you're, like, all for animal testing and you think that humans are, like, way better than animals. Honey, let me tell you something. You're a young girl. You're only 17. Yeah. One day when your mommy and daddy are laid in the hospital with cancer, which they will be. Okay. What's that got to do with animals? Oh, I'm getting to it. Don't rush me. <laughs> One day when your mommy and daddy are laying in bed with the cancer, and the doctor walks in and he goes, guess what? We just got a new operation. We could take monkeys and transplant everything into your parents and keep them alive? You'll say, okay. No, wait, I couldn't uh, look at my what? parents after that and, like, still... What did you say? I couldn't look at my parents in the same way, knowing that, like, monkeys and a sentence... All right, let's say your dad has a heart attack, and they could save him in the future by giving him a pig's heart. No, oh, they do do that right now. Yeah, and you and you would be against your dad living? Um, yes. You, you, no, wait a second. Think of your dad. Do you like I, your dad? I love my dad and everything. You love your dad? Yes. You say you love your dad. You see, this is why I, I, I'm sorry I had kids. Listen to this little ingrate. Her dad is laying in the hospital dying, and she would rather keep a pig alive than Let her own me father. Ask you something. Would you give your child a kidney? No, not me. I'm very selfish. Uh, See? Yeah, but I give him a pig's kidney. If you won't do it, why should the pig? Ah, uh, bull. Pig is nothing. <laughs> no, and hopefully that will stop. Pig is here to serve man. No way. That's you mean not. to tell me if your dad was... Let me ask you something, honey. If you're laying in a hospital and your heart gives out, and they can put a pig's heart in you, you don't want it? No, I don't You want lying, it. little, filthy... No, no, I don't want any... You are a lying, little, filthy... Just for me. Why am I better than the pig or a monkey or anything? I'm not... You aren't. I, exactly. Well, and neither are you. You're much worse than the pig, the monkey, or the lion. Right. <laughs> You're insane. I'm not insane. And I'm not the only one who thinks so. It doesn't matter. Well, I'm not the only one who thinks like me. I'm nah, you don't even think like you. Think of who do you love most on this planet? Who do you love the most? I don't think I love anybody that uh, People who... Oh, who do you love the most? Myself. Oh, okay. But that's just us. <laughs> okay. A lot of people don't. Let me tell you something. Uh, let me tell you something, sweetheart. You're insane. <laughs> I'm not insane. And there are Who do you love on this planet? Do you have a boyfriend? Not now. You got a, you got a mother? Yeah. You love your mother? Yes. Was she good to you? Yes. And your mother's laying in a hospital near death and they could save her life with a pig's heart and you wouldn't give it to her? You say uh, that now. I, I think you're lying. I don't think you're thinking of your mother. Well, hopefully I'll change. I'm going to start an organization at my college at UCLA. Um, UCLA? Yeah. Oh. What are you, gay? No, why? What? Why? Why? Only I don't know why you're gay. UCLA? Mostly gays go to UCLA. Oh, my God. I've been over there. I was jogging over there. I saw mostly gays. Right, Fred? Absolutely. All right. Well, I'm not. 99%. Okay. <laughs> Look that way to me. No way. I didn't see one masculine one man. man. <laughs> I sure didn't. I'm only vegan. No wonder you don't have a boyfriend. Yeah, yeah, everyone over there is a vegan. <laughs> yeah, vegan. No, By the time you're 20, you ain't going to be no vegan. I wish. But you know why? I know all these people. They're 17. They're vegans. And then uh, all of a sudden, the time they hit 20, the doctor calls my room and says, listen, you got no goddamn calcium in your bones. You got bones. You got the bones of a 90-year-old woman. Go drink a glass of milk, you bitch. I enjoy milk because it has enough calcium and enough, like, proteins and everything as much as regular milk. What'd she say? I oh, said soy milk. Soy milk. Soy milk? What's that? That's not milk. Yes, it is. Soy milk. Soy, <laughs> soy milk. Hey, you know, you vegans. I'm sick of all of you. Soy milk. I tasted that once. That's not milk. You know what that is? I tasted a really gross one, but the one that they sell for, like, vegans, they flavor them. Vegans? Uh, yes. They sell it for vegans. Well, oh, vegetarian vegans. They clever uh, ones. And they make it taste good. They are like vanilla and carob, and it tastes really good. Right. Some of us don't want the animals to die for us. I know. I see. Well, I do. I'm for it. I I'm know, for you'd like to kill a few people. Yep. <laughs> well, you have, right? Soy milk. I see these vegans drinking soy milk. Urine is healthier than soy milk. Oh, my God. Yeah. No. 
Hello? Hello. Yeah, this is Jane. She wants to yell at you. Um, no, I don't want to yell at her. I just want to say that we are animals, and animals eat other animals. It's just the natural thing to of do. Course. Of so course. So I'm going to go upstairs, and I'm going to have eggs for breakfast, bacon for breakfast, <laughs> milk, and everything else Good. that I can think of. Now, she a, a pig. <laughs> and do me a favor. Have a double portion for me. I will. All right? Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Now you've made me want to eat more meat. <laughs> you said that I'm unhealthy. She's going to be unhealthy with all the cholesterol and saturated fat and all Ah, uh, big deal. It won't hurt her. Well, then she'll die before me. No, I won't. Okay. Nah, she's I'm healthy probably as a more horse. healthy than you. Well, Eggs are good for you. They're from a chicken's ass. ass. I didn't. I didn't care about animals. <laughs> I didn't care about animals at all before. But hey, lady, let me ask you something. This is Jane. Yeah. Let me ask you something. If you, who do you love, Jane? Uh, I, I'm with Robin. I'm honest. I love myself. Yeah, but I mean, like, do you have a husband or a father or something? I have a boyfriend. A boyfriend. If your boyfriend, do you like your parents? Oh yeah. All right. Imagine your parents were in a car accident, and they they lost their vision, and they said they got a new operation. They could take a monkey's eyes and stick them in your father's head so he can see. See, like a baboon. Like a baboon. <laughs> what, what would you do? Oh yeah, I'd do it. In a second. Yeah. And so would this little vegan. And then she'd no. eat the baboon. No, yeah, I'd... and then I'd eat the baboon. I'd eat his brain. Oh, that's gross. Of course They're I would. Very sick people. You're this is the dumbest be, thing. Don't even let them get you riled up. You know, they they, 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 they got all kind of animal research that is saving mankind. They do horrible no, things to these animals. Not horrible enough. Uh, you go on PETA online, you'll learn... PETA is going to ruin my future. I am I am getting older. They I want to live. They the animals just to see what happens. I know, I know a guy. I know a guy. He uh, lost the cart. In 